Ask the poll question to Hank here, uh, Christopher. Ask the poll question. I saw right. the poll question. Yeah, what is the natural? Oh, really? You, you didn't even stutter. Yeah. The natural. No. Why? I love that movie. That's one of those movies. Not only is it my favorite baseball movie, but it's one of those movies that goes in my pantheon of if it's on, I will watch it to the end. My remote drop. A remote drop. Doesn't matter yeah, where it is. It. Doesn't matter I'm where it is. With- because, no. you know, Goodfellas is up there with me. And that front, uh, The Fugitive is another one of those movies where it doesn't matter. you got to drop the road. The natural's that way for you. Yes. Um, I, uh, Goodfellas, yes. Godfather 1 and 2, yes. If it's on, I must watch it. But, you know, here's if I asked this uh, on Twitter the other day. <laughs> yes. There's certain great movies we'll all watch if they're on. Yes. Like, those are all good movies. Is there any horrible movie that if it's on you? I, I have two really bad movies that if they're on, I will watch. You have them. the floor, Hank. What do you have? Uh, cocktail, <laughs> and then the the granddaddy of them all is Roadhouse. Roadhouse. I was about to oh, say they, they were both on over the weekend. <laughs> <laughs> is that why you? I said that, Hank. <laughs> no, I, I didn't even know that. I just I actually have a poster of Roadhouse. I'm looking at it right I, in front of me. Is is my buddy Ernie gave me the painting? You know. From Goodfellas, one dog looking this way, one looking that way. We were talking way, about that just me. last week. Yes, you have that painting in your I'm house. I'm looking at that right now. Then, if I look to my left, I have the poster of Roadhouse. Those are the two things in my office. <laughs> oh my gosh! Because we were discussing that Roadhouse. Because I had mentioned I have never seen Hank Roadhouse credits to credits. I've always dropped in and seen <laughs> it here and there. In. I can't. I can't. Re- dr- I, I. I. I actually pick up the remote after a while. I can't get through it. I just can't. That, oh, I'm the opposite. My God, I can't. I've seen it I, I, dozens of times. God, I love it. You know <laughs> why? It's, why? Well, it's well, bad. It's terrible. The fights are fun. The uh, the fights are fun. The music is fun. Jeff Hilly do a lot of good uh, uh, um, uh, blues music in it, and uh, it's just so bad. It's good. It's just so horrible. It, ben Gazzara doing this crazy over the top villain, and Sam Elliott, you know. Hitting you in the knee and going, that hurts, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's just, it's just fantastic. I don't know. Oh my gosh! Wait, what do you, what don't you like about cocktail? <laughs> yeah, I love co- if cocktails. On, I must. It's just a bad. I consider it a bad movie, but uh, not a second of it is believable. These two <laughs> bartenders uh, take over the world. I don't understand <laughs> what the premise is. Uh, but, but, uh, but but Hank, they're they're, they're but Hank, they're they're flipping the drinks around as they as they make a cocktail. They're they're having... exactly. It's fun. I like. I think I enjoy watching the screenwriter really strain. So like, how is a bartender going to matter in the world? The next ten pages of the script. I don't know. <laughs> what what has what's the uh, most you had to rehearse something like similar to flipping something up in the air for any of the roles that you've done, Hank? Oh, easily. Uh... And, when, and Mystery Men, when I played the Blue Raja, I had to actually learn some sleight of hand with fork, like making forks appear. What? Appear. Yeah, I had to actually learn some fork sleight of hand. You know what? I forgot. Took a lot of I forgot about Mystery Men. So you've been in two films with the word mystery in, in the title, that and Mystery Alaska. Yeah, they, they and they almost came out concurrently, and they were part of a triple play that nearly ended my career. <laughs> all did so poorly. <laughs> <laughs> was you know, complete that failure hat trick? Uh, Herman, Herman's head? Herman's head? No, that was early, <laughs> the early days. Of, that was on the way up. That was like a break, and that, you know, got me working. What was no, the other one? What the, was... The, the, the three big breaks I got that all went into the toilet almost concurrently <laughs> were Mystery Alaska, Mystery Men, and Godzilla. What? Yeah. The Matthew Broderick version? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I prefer to think of it as the Hank Azaria version. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe people are dropping their remotes because it's too good of a bad movie. Mystery Alaska doesn't get a lot. Of- I like that movie. Yeah, Hank. Not a bad, no, neither is Mystery Men. They're both. Actually, all three are not bad at all. Mystery Men's a very fun movie. It right. just didn't do very well at the box office. Mystery Alaska is a perfectly fine movie. Well, And uh, Godzilla's not as bad as people make it out. At all. Well, thankfully, it's all worked out well for you, Hank, um, from uh, everything that you've done. Um, also, uh, The Simpsons is in uh, season 3000, correct? Is that what it is? What's, <laughs> 32. We actually just we just we just read our 700th episode. Come on. 
Yeah. 700 ridiculous. episodes? That is absolutely yeah. insane. Nothing gets 700 episodes. Nothing. That's totally crazy. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.